So what I'm fishing here is my <coughs> my 11 foot 8 weight 6 or excuse me <laughs> yeah it's an 11 foot 6 inch 8 weight um, this is pretty much my bread and butter for a multitude of reasons first off my entire rod series, all the Renegades, are all what I call true rod weight. And true rod weight meaning that this is actually an 8. It doesn't say 8 on the badge and it's a 9 or a 10. It's an 8. And why I make that statement is, is that the line system I fish on it is roughly about 100 or 500 grains. It's about maybe 525 at the heaviest end. That's including the sink tip. So it's the head and the tip combined creating the optimum casting package for a true eight weight rod. I personally like that because I don't want to fish a 910 for steelhead. I want to fish a real nine weight like my nine weight and that allows you to actually feel the fish, have some fun, still be able to cast far and aren't overdoing it. So going back to the 11.6 um, eight weight, this rod is what I consider the ideal steelhead tool for everything we do here in Washington, out on the coast, in the inland rivers, you know, in the Puget Sound area. And the reason why is, is it's, you know, obviously here, this is, there's no back casting problems here, but for the most part, a lot of the places that we're fishing, they're pretty jammed up and there's not a lot of room. So this 11 foot, six inch length is pretty ideal. But really the magic in these rods is the action. And the action is, it's nothing new, but it's what I consider ideal as far as having a tool that works with you and not something you have to cast. Granted, I am going through physical motion to make this rod cast, but this rod is actually working with me and the reason is, is because it's, it's a medium fast progressive action. And nowadays, people pick them up and they, they feel kind of slow, but the, the, the magic in a medium fast progressive action is the key word, not regressive, meaning that the rod is really stiff up on the top end or and it flexes in the bottom or it's really stiff bottom and top and flexes in the middle. This rod progressively flexes into the handle. And what the advantage to that is, is that you get this extremely clean load. That extremely clean load, it loads quickly and it recovers quickly. And in those two combination, that's, that's, those, that is it helping you cast. And so, the, the ideal length being that, like I said, you have, you end up with, got a big mess here, you end up with um, not only the ideal length rod, but your line system is nice and short as well. This is only, this is two and a half times the length of the rod, which means I can easily manipulate it, work it. I could cast it with a single hand. And, you know, it's 11 foot, 6 inch, 8 weight. And it is because the system is tailored to the, to the length of the rod. And when that's the case, if, you're, if I was trying to fish, like, let's say, a 25 foot head on this rod, it would be an absolute nightmare. It would, it's, you know, three times the length of the rod almost. It's, just, it's not going to work. And you add a sink tip to the front end of that, and you're just talking about kicking your own butt all day long. So the, when I designed the Renegades, it was an opportunity to take and create something that was what I can see, consider to be the ideal length and weight for the purpose. And with that said, 11 foot 6 inch 8 weight with this action, I've caught adult kings on this rod. And it, is, it was ideal. It was, it was, it was really really fun that's basically where I can put it you know you work down to my seven weight it's an 11 foot seven there's a 10 foot six inch six weight that these are true weight rods the six weight throwing roughly you know two seven two fifty to two seventy five and it's just buttery and it's really really fun for you know things that are six weight like ideal trout rod you know and not a six weight that's 12 feet long that's really a seven or an eight that just it's not beneficial and it's also not fun so that when you the combination of the length and the weight of the rod just being light and then it's 
the biomechanical efficiency of it allows me, you know, at 53 years old, I can fish for many, many days in a row with no fatigue and, and really enjoy my fishing. The handles on the Renegades are all tailored to the length of the rod, meaning they're not too heavy on the foregrip or on the lower handle. The lower handles are identical on the two longer rods, and then the grip becomes relative to the length of the rod, so the balance is roughly, and the grip length is where it should be on all the two-handers, roughly at shoulder length. So it's a nice, comfortable top and bottom grip. And then something not as important but very cool is the composite cork. This is a byproduct, and the byproduct not only looks cool, but it has an incredible feel and grip to it when it's wet. The running line doesn't slip out of my fingers very anymore very well and it has really nice traction and a wonderful feel to it so the the combination of length weight and you know ideal grip handle just makes the tool a, more of a partner than a fishing rod I love loves me Her sweet love Tommy 